What's up guys, Jock217, we are back to the LP of Kingdom Hearts Rechain of Memories. Alright, I did a lot of off-screen grinding this time. <laughs> In fact, I did so much to the point to where I learned two new abilities. The first one is my favorite ability, Sonic Blade. Um, you need three different attack cards and they have to be at least 20 to 23. And my, actually this is my favorite one right here, Lethal Flame. You stop time and deal multiple blows on an enemy. I will show you what that does in a minute. Because both of those two are probably going to be the most spammed attacks you will ever use in this game. Trust me. Alright. So, anyway. I did a bunch of grinding to where um, I raised up a bunch of my MP, I mean MP, HP, and CP as well. So, yeah. It was very, very, it was very fun. And I also got a shitload of Moogle points because... Um, I leveled up in Agrabah, so, yeah, you will see how much I have. And here we are in Halloween Town. Jack Skellington's World and my favorite Tim Burton movie. Gorsh doesn't, don't like the looks of this place. I bet it's crawling with ghosts. Ah, fooey, there's nothing to worry about. Yeah, I've decided from here on out that I am not going to try to Im imitate Donald's voice anymore. <laughs> Unless I have, like, a throat problem. You won't be spooked if you already know what's coming. Not even real ghosts can frighten us anymore. If they take one look at us, they'll be the ones to run away. You really think so? Trust me. Welcome to Halloween Town. Whack a ghost! <laughs> wow, that was the best shriek I've heard in ages. If you're that easy to scare, we're gonna have a great time. Sorry, I haven't even introduced myself. I'm Jack Skellington, and this is Halloween Town. People around here call me the Pumpkin King. So if you're looking for a ghoulishly good time, you've come to the right place. Well, we aren't! <laughs> Too bad, because at the moment we've got a bit of problem in Halloween Town. What kind of problem? Well... Like this! Yeah! Yep, we enter the world and we already start fighting Heartless. <laughs> that sound familiar? <laughs> Man, I like this music. I love this world and I love this music. My best friend is trying to find some excuse for Halloween Town to be in Kingdom Hearts 3, but I keep telling him that they are done and it's not gonna happen. He just doesn't want to admit it. But, oh well. Yeah, um, I will show you what Lethal Flame does very soon. <laughs> you'll, it, you'll see why it is the most spammed attack. And is that Jack? Okay. Alright, are you ready? Here we go. <laughs> is that not badass or what? Oh, that is so cool. I love that attack. Uh, truth be told, if that attack was in every single Kingdom Hearts game, that would be my favorite attack of all time. But sadly, it is only in this one. Last time I checked. So, it is going to be Sonic Blade. Which you haven't seen in this game yet either. If you were watching my uh, Kingdom Hearts 1 Final Mix LP, then yeah, you saw it already. <laughs> he doesn't suck, people. <laughs> yes, that is going to be a tradition. Every time I use Omnislash in my LP, I am going to say that line at least once. <laughs> Where's the White Knight? Hey, you. Get over here. Doom. Mmm. Mmm. Five. Six. Uh, yeah, see, that's the only downside. In order for Sonic Blade to keep going, you have to actually hit the person. If you don't, then it'll just stop automatically. But, oh well. I love those attacks. Those are my two favorite attacks of all time. In every Kingdom Hearts game. That and Mega Flare. But I haven't got that yet. Which is a shame. <laughs> yeah, but I agree with my best friend. I really like this world, and and if they really put Nightmare Before Christmas in uh, Kingdom Hearts 3, I wouldn't complain, but I already know they're not, because they finished it. They can't do anything else. I mean, the best they can do is put Jack as a summon. Other than that, they can't do anything else. What's the big idea? Why'd you go and call the Heartless? I didn't call them. I just know, knew when they were going to show up. In fact, I'd love to get rid of them. They're actually going around attacking people instead of just scaring them. Why are they here? I was going to I was just going to ask Dr. Finkelstein the same question. I'm heading to his laboratory right now. Follow me. 
<laughs> Sora, what should we do? I guess we better go. I don't like this. What if he's leading us right to the Heartless? Bingo! You saw right through me! <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Now let's get going. I love Jack. Jack is cool. Sora learns terror. Strike fear in the enemy so they no longer approach. Um, you can use two summon cards and Jack for that one, or you can use Simba, Mushu, and an item card. I never used terror. <laughs> I used it like once and I don't like it. And like some of these slates are cool and other slates are just completely useless. Um, yeah, I'm trying to like, you know, keep a balance for my audio to come out because it's quiet hours right now. And I don't want to sound too quiet in my LPs. I want to be able to express myself while at the same time well, at the same time, you know, yeah, keeping quiet to where I don't get in trouble. But, you know, oh well. And here we are in Halloween Town. And... <laughs> How badass is that attack? Oh my gosh, I love that attack with a passion. I'm so glad they invented that attack. Man, why can't that attack be in other Kingdom Hearts games? Why? Uh, oh well. And I'm not going to show many heartless fights in this one. Because, um, there's actually going to be uh, two boss battles coming out. And watch out for that thing. Ah, oh, crap, I got into a heartless battle. Dang it. Oh well. I'm getting rid of these plants first because they get on my nerves. These plants are a pain in the ass. Die! Thank you. <laughs> and repeat. <laughs> See, you you are gonna use this attack, guaranteed. <laughs> if you're gonna play this LP, like if you're gonna play Kingdom Hearts Chain of Memories or Rechain of Memories, it is guaranteed you're gonna use that attack. That and Lethal Flame if you're playing Rechain of Memories. Oh, I'm about to level up anyway. Huh? One more battle. Yeah, but um, I'm not going to fight too many Heartless in this world because um, this, if you're paying attention to the last episode, we are indeed going to fight Larkseen, who is no joke. Trust me. Um, that, which is specifically why I took my time to level up a shitload. Because, um... She is no joke at all. She is not. She is hard, and I cannot wait to fight her in Kingdom Hearts 2.5. Oh, I can't wait for that game! Uh, get back here already. Get get here. Get in America. So I can start doing an LP of that, too. Uh, it's going to be a blind LP, too, since I never, ever, ever played Kingdom Hearts 2 Final Mix. Ever. Uh, I want to play that game so badly. <laughs> He doesn't suck, people. All right, I think we're probably gonna stick. We're probably only gonna say that like twice or three times. And I'm gonna raise up my CP. All right, that's enough. Now I'm just gonna go into the next world, and let's see where I gotta go first. Oh, okay, so just go right there and then right there. All right, perfect. All right, and let's check out the Calm Bounty exclusive. And I believe this is one of the worlds where there are two Calm Bounty exclusives. I'm not too sure, but I am pretty positive that this is one of the um, worlds where there's two Calm Bounty exclusives instead of just one. I'm pretty positive on that. I'm not going to bet money on it due to the fact that I am really, 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 really broke right now. But um, nonetheless, nonetheless, I'm pretty positive that this is a double Calm Bounty exclusive. I'm gonna call it that from here on out. It's a double calm bounty exclusive. A world where there's a two calm bounty exclusives. Alright, and ooh, another stop. Nice. That's that's what you need for the lethal flame. I'm just gonna strike everything around here real quick. Alright, then open the chest, and I believe this is a gifted miracle. Yep. What that does is um it resets your reload time and it heals everything including enemies so honestly I see no point in that attack that that's why the hell would I use that why why would I use that it's, it makes no sense I love the song 
In this town of Halloween, this is Halloween, this is Halloween. I don't know the rest of the words, but I really don't care because I love this song. I really don't care that I don't know it all. <laughs> And then open this chest right here. Is this a double calm bounty? Oh, no, it's not. Okay, this is just one. I know there are worlds out there where there's double calm bounty exclusives. I know that. I know that much. But, um, oh well. I thought this was one of them. Okay. This is where the criteria gets frustrating. I'm telling you, I, you are, you are gonna hate this game if you don't already. <laughs> Would you like to see something strange? But we're not mean in this town of Halloween. I know that I mixed up all the parts. <laughs> Allow me to introduce Dr. Finkelstein. He's a world famous genius. Yes, maybe I'm too smart. I'm afraid I've created something horrible. What's that? Well, have you ever stopped to think about the power of true memories? True memories? You see, my boy, our hearts are full of memories. But not all of them reflect the truth. The heart isn't a recording device. Even important memories change with time. They warp or fade, leaving us with but a shadow of what we hoped to remember. Could that be happening to me? It happens to everyone. Some memories grow ugly and some become more beautiful. If we could recover our true memories, the world would seem completely different. So I devised a potion from forget-me-nots that brings our true memories back. Did it work? Well, that's the problem. As soon as the doctor got a whiff of the potion, Heartless started popping up. Sounds like a failed experiment to me. No, my research is flawless! I just need another look at the potion to find out what went wrong. Stubborn scientist, Dr. Finkelstein. <laughs> Unfortunately, it's vanished. Maybe someone swiped it? It must have been Sally! Jack, you got to find her and get my potion back. Leave it to me. Can I tag along? What for? I want to know more about those true memories the doctor keeps talking about. Excellent. Then let's go find Sally. <laughs> Keep guidance. <laughs> mm, maybe I voiced Dr. Finkelstein pretty good. I don't know. If it wasn't quiet hours, I would be like a lot more louder and more confident. But it is quiet hours and I don't want to get in trouble. But then again, at the same time, I'm trying to keep it balanced. <laughs> Alrighty, and let's see here. We go. Wait. Okay, see, this is what I hate about Chain of Memories. Okay, we're supposed to go to that room next, but I'm not sure if we go to this room so we can go to that room, or if we have to go all the way over here to go into that room. I'm not sure. I'm gonna go right here, but I bet you anything I have to go to that room. But let's find out. <laughs> what is this? Oh, that's key to rewards. I will indeed come back for that. In fact, I believe that the next episode is actually going to... In fact, yeah, the next episode is going to be um, key to rewards. Getting all the key rewards in the past worlds. Because I know in the next world you get um, you get the uh, key to rewards. You start getting key to rewards because you don't get them until the second half. Alright, and let's go here to the Mooga Room. <laughs> Pumpkin head, nice. Alright, and <laughs> like the amount of Moogle points I got there. <laughs> uh, it's cool, isn't it? 
I got all of that from Agrabah in one go. You want to level up at Agrabah. That is the place to go. Well, if you want Moogle points, at least. If you want Moogle points, go to Agrabah. That is the best place to go. Go to Agrabah, spam Aladdin. <laughs> that is the best way to get Moogle points. In fact, I could probably buy this whole store right now if I wanted to, but I never use item cards. Alright, come on. Please, for the love of fuck, give it to me. And you still don't want to give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Fuck. <sighs> Come on. Ah, fuck you then. Oh my god. All these tries and it still doesn't want to give me clout. All right. And I'm not going to spend any more Moogle points. And let me see, let me see which, what's strong pumpkin head, like what's strongest when it comes to pumpkin head. Uh, oh, it's the exact same thing as lady luck, man, that's, okay, there's no point. And see, I was right, I was fucking right. Uh, you have to go all the way around there. Alright, um, I'll meet you guys there. Okay, we're back guys. All right, here we are to the door with the key of guidance. Um, okay, we need a six on the dot. We need a seven on the dot. Oh no, dang it! All right, and a key to guidance. Yep. So um, I just made another Moogle room and a place to save, and I still didn't get a cloud in the other Moogle room. Oh, my God, why is that card so hard to get? Because it's powerful and good. That's why. <laughs> That's our job, but we're not mean. In this town of Halloween. There you are, Sally. I thought I'd find you here. Who are your friends? They're interested in true memories. You have the potion, don't you? Well, yes. Could you give it back? I guess so, if you insist. But I'm afraid. All the doctor did was smell it and the heart disappeared. What if someone drinks it? Are you kidding? What could be more exciting? I'm worried, Jack. Isn't there another option? Any ideas, Jack? I can't think of a thing. I can't give it here! <laughs> Mr. Oogie okay, Boogie! Oh no! The potion! Oogie! Okay, you again! <laughs> Jack, where are your manners? I'm just helping you put the potion to good use. You should thank me. Well, well, just one sniff and the heartless appeared. What would happen if I chugged the whole thing? That would be scary. Poor Jack, you can't hold a candle to Oogie Boogie. Time for Halloween Town to taste pain and despair beyond any nightmare. Pain and despair? Oogie, you monster. Come on, Jack, we gotta go after him. Yeah, you guys can just cast fire right there. <laughs> I should probably uh not intimidate Oogie's voice. <laughs> Cause um I don't know if I do it good or not. I think I do, but um I'll, I'll let you guys decide that. But um I do it loud. <laughs> so uh yeah, I just thought I'd note that. I don't know, I I am a little bit loud while trying to do Oogie's voice. I think I do it good, but I'll let you guys decide that. <laughs> Dang it! Ah, fuck. Okay. Well, anyway, um, all we're doing is um, we're just gonna go to the. All we're doing is just going to the uh, Kia Truth right here. So, um, yeah, I'll meet you there. Okay, we're back. So, um, now what I'm gonna do is just um, I'm gonna create a save point here, cause um, I know the next fight is um. It's not hard, it's just really, really aggravating. It's just, uh, it's despicable. <laughs> but of course, naturally, I'm going to hit everything around me. <laughs> and I hope and hope and pray that there is no static in this video. Because in my, uh, in my, uh, in the most recent video I did of, uh, Kingdom Hearts uh, 1 Final Mix when I was in Deep Jungle, there was just so much static beyond belief that I was far beyond pissed and some of it I couldn't delete at all because I was in the middle of a really important cutscene so I mean I've done everything I could so the only thing I 
the only thing it looks like I, I can do is just edit it out completely and if it's in a cutscene deal with it <laughs> that's the only thing I can do I mean it's not like I can just absorb static from my microphone and take it out I wish I could that'd be awesome uh, or I wish I could actually hear when the static is going off because then it'd be a whole lot easier and I could just like wait for it but oh well Mm -hmm. This Halloween, this is Halloween, 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 the song, we go home, everyone do to the pumpkin song. Alright, here we are facing Oogie. Oogie, hand over the potion. You fools don't know when to quit. Say, all this running around is making me thirsty. Oogie, no. Yes. And Oogie's gonna drink the potion. And he chugged it down. I wonder what it tastes like. Oh no. Ah, lip smacking good. Ah, what's this? What? Something's wrong. Something deep inside me. Something scary. Oogie, what's going on? No! Get back! Stay away from me! <laughs> I don't know. Do, do, do I do a good Oogie voice? Or? Let me know in the comments. Let me know if I do a good Oogie voice. Oh yeah, and this this is why the battle is aggravating. You're gonna need cards with like a seven or higher, or if you want to, you can just destroy one of those dice that he destroys. Use the zero card to bring the cage down, and then bombard him with attacks. He doesn't have slates or zero cards or anything. All he does is just use seven cards over and over and over. So yeah, this this fight isn't hard at all. It's just aggravating because you have to card break him. Otherwise, it's not gonna work. So it's probably best just to use attack cards. See, there it is again. See, it's the best. Once you get a zero card, just use it. It's a lot easier. Okay, now it'll freeze you. <clears throat> Goofy. So it seems like the middle dice is always the one that has the Mickey Mouse card. Ooh, if Donald kills him, die! Yeah, go Donald. For once, Donald actually gets a kill. <laughs> and Donald's a pretty good ally to have. Especially once you get Kieran Kingdom Hearts 1. And here we get Oogie Boogie, a really, really, really good enemy card. Trust me, it is very, very good and handy to have. Um, I think I actually will use it in this LP, along with a couple of other cards as well. Mm -hmm. Confound that Oogie Boogie! He drank nearly all of my precious potion! There's only a few drops left! Sora, why don't you ask the dog if you can drink the rest? No, I'd better not. What? Don't you want it? Too bad. It would have been a great experiment! Now, Doctor, don't you want to find out about your true memories? Of course, now more than ever. But there's this guy, Axel. I promised I'd find the truth on my own. I just don't understand. When I inhaled the potion, Heartless appeared. And when Oogie drank it, he was overcome with fear. What could it mean? 
It means the potion was a failure. No, it can't be wrong. Ogi must have found his true memories. Hmm, true memories must unbalance the heart and cause unpredictable changes within. <laughs> then what about me? What happens if my true memories awaken? Perhaps something even more terrifying. But this is all just a hypothesis. I can't be sure without further research. <laughs> Maybe I do Dr. Finkelstein's voice better. I'm not sure. What's wrong, Sora? Does the doctor's theory scare you? Well, yeah, a little. That's good to hear. Fear and doubt are signs of a strong heart. They push your heart, strike out in new directions, take chances. Without them, your zest for life might fade. As with your taste for fear, and believe me, that would really ruin my fun. Thanks, Jack. I'll remember that. Then good luck, gentlemen. May you always be may you always enjoy being frightened. Well, that is, isn't that a really special greeting? <laughs> I love this world, and um, it's a shame that they finally, finally finished it. I mean, I would love to see it in Kingdom Hearts 3 just as much as my best friend would, but I already know for a fact that it's not going to happen. If they're going to do anything with Nightmare Before Christmas, at best, they're going to make Jack a summon. That That's the only thing they're going to do, just make Jack Skellington a summon. That's it. Or maybe give you a Nightmare Before Christmas Keyblade. Other than that, they're not really not going to do much more with Nightmare Before Christmas. It's a shame to admit, but it's the truth. This is Halloween. Okay. Um, since this is the last world, at least for me, if you chose something else, that's fine. Save the game. Do it. Okay. Save the fucking game. Do. This is Halloween. This is Halloween. Alright, and save the game. Why? Because we are getting into another boss fight. And here's a cutscene. Let me shut up. memories and awaken the true memories <laughs> that lie deep in your heart true memories although it seems that you're still forgetting the most important thing here when that poor girl hears that you've forgotten her name why it'll just it'll break her heart poor girl do you know her <laughs> Is she... here? Yes, she is. You see, the bad guys are holding her captive somewhere deep inside the castle. And you obviously are the hero, so you have to go save her. Although... I'm a bad guy, so you have to go through me. Sora! What's that? Is that thing mine? What a shame! You've been wearing it all this time and forgot? No, that's not possible. The memory has to be engraved somewhere deep inside your heart. Sora, you think carefully now. What, oh what, could it be? And who gave it to you? Nah. Nah. Meh. Sora, Sora! You're getting it now! Release the memory from within your heart! Nam Namine. Well... It's about time. That's right, Namine. Yes, she's the one that gave you that tacky little good luck charm. Not that you even bothered to remember. 
No surprise, seeing as you also couldn't remember her name. <laughs> Talk about heartless, I can't believe you. It'd serve you right if I decided to smash this piece of junk. Let it go! Nominate gave me this. It's very important to me. Oh, it's important to you. Ten seconds ago, you didn't even know what it was. Like scene. <laughs> okay, um, this battle, I wouldn't be surprised if I die right now. <laughs> to be told, I am actually scared to fight her right now. <sighs> And is it just me, or is, um, like, seem kind of hot? <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I, I find her hot. I mean, she's got nothing on Kyrie, but still. Lethal flame. Don't break it. Yeah! Yeah. Yeah, her attacks are powerful. She's got high cards, everything. I wouldn't be surprised if I die to her today. I'm not going to be confident and say I'm going to kill her. Because I am honestly scared to fight her. In this game and in Kingdom Hearts 2.5 Final Mix. But at the same time, I cannot wait. Yeah, I knew Cloud would get broken. Like, okay, Cloud is slow, and he might not be as effective in this fight, but that's just because Larxene is so damn fast. <laughs> oh my gosh. Die! Thank you, gosh. Okay, so, um... Alright, so this first fight isn't bad, but I know for a fact... I know she is going to be a bitch later on. She has a bitchy personality, but at the same time, she's hot. <laughs> and you get Thunder. And of course, naturally, I'm going to be using that attack. Cutscene, let me shut up. <laughs> You're not as bad as I thought. You really are a hero. A heartless hero. Who asked you? Oh, does it hurt because it's the truth? You are just a baby. And if you're gonna be a baby, then here you go. I created another card from your memories, you know. Be a good boy and say thanks. Ta-ta. Wait, Larxene! Don't you dare hide from me! Show yourself! Sora, calm down! She's not coming back! Sora? I hate this. Why'd I need someone like that to bring back... Nominee's memory? And we get four new world cards. <laughs> yep. And yeah, and you know what? I swear to God, I can't help it. Nominate, I mean, not nominate, Lark Scene. She's, she's pretty hot, actually. She's got a little something. I don't know. I just, I don't know. I don't know. I can't describe it. I know she's a bitch, but still. that battle wore me out really it looked to me like you just plain lost <laughs> how dare you you don't appreciate the nuances of an ungainly huh? vexen how could you be humbled by someone of such limited significance you shame the organization <sighs> How can we help you, Vexen? It's not very often we see you topside. I came to lend you a hand. You obviously believe this Sora has much potential. 
but I remain unconvinced he is truly worth such coddling. I think an experiment would show if he really is of any value to us. <laughs> well, here we go again. It's just an excuse, so you can carry out your little experiments, that's all. I'm a scientist. Experiments are what I do. Yes. Whatever. You can do what you want. But you know, I think testing Sora is just a cover for testing your valet. Valet? He's the product of pure research. What he actually is, is a toy. Hm. You should just learn to be quiet. Anyway, since you came all this way, you're gonna need this. A humble gift to my elder. I hope you use it to put on a very good show for us. We gotta rescue her! Whew. Sora sure does seem like he's upset. You be too. He just remembered a friend, but found out she's in trouble. Good point. I guess if we heard that the king was in danger, we would be pretty upset about that too. <laughs> yep. Um, well, so yep, and let me tell you, if you were pretty bored with this LP, then things are just going to start getting way more interesting and difficult from here on out. So, um, that's going to have to do it for this episode, because I still got editing to do, so we'll see you guys later. Be safe. <laughs>